It's just another Magic Mail Thursday, oh, yo. It's been a Blur's Day, oh, yo. That's all I got. I can't think of anything else that rhymes. So, anyway, let's get cracking! <laughs> Hello all my explorers and welcome back to Lauren's Adventures Out There. And if you are new, thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate it. My name is Lauren and I'm with Castle Escapes and Clones where we discuss everything in the Disney universe. We do unboxings and hauls, pins, box watch, Disney news, Disney reviews and more. So if that sounds fun to you, we'd love it if you would subscribe to our channel, hit the bell for notifications and do like this post as it really does help us out. Okay, so I'm starting to get ahead of myself with the Magic Mail Monday, so that's why we are doing it Thursday again today. Yay! Anywho, let's go ahead and get started. So this first package I'm very excited about. This is from uh, my friend Memory, who is on a uh, restaurant chat group with me. And uh, you might remember her. Um, from other Magic Mail Mondays where she had been selling off her collection, her rescue collection, for one reason or the other. And, um, you know, I had bought some of the pieces from her. And uh, anyway, I just decided to check and see if she had anything left, and she did. And I bought a bunch of stuff. I didn't buy everything. Some of it I had still already, but um, others I just didn't get. But this is a card, as always, Disney Mems 29. And I just love this card. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into some of these packages. Um, we're gonna open this one first. Let's see who it is. I can't. I remember some of what I got, but I can't remember all of it. Um, but all I know is she had a great collection. And she's managed to sell off most of it, like most everything she sold. Um, so that's good for her. Since she's wanted, she wanted to sell it off. Uh, okay, so this first pin is Madame Medusa. Oh, look at this. She put it on a recollection card. Does it? Oh, I guess maybe does this go on this card? <gasps> That's so cool. Oh my gosh, look at that. And there she is right there. I just love her so much, Madame Medusa. I do. Okay. Uh, let's go into this one. I'm always so afraid that I'm going to cut into the card when I when I do all the cutting. But, and she's really good at, like, protecting the packages with the tape. Um, but sometimes I can't see and I can't tell if I'm cutting the package, uh, cutting the card or cutting into whatever. Okay, so this next one is come on. Okay, so I had gotten the Madame Medusa cutie, and what is to follow up with a Madame Medusa Disney Studio Store Hollywood cutie than with McLeach? from Rescuers Down Under. That's cool, and there's little Joanna. Nice, I love it. Okay, this next one is, let's see. I think a lot of these are Madame Medusa oriented. Okay, so 
like this one is a dangle pin. So this one is a dangle pin for my face. It's Disneyland. And what does it say on here? Uh, gators, pets, or pets or purses. Madame Medusa Brass Bio Beauty. That's very cute. I love that. And I think this is an older pen. It doesn't have the waffle back. I can't see the date, but let's see if anybody else on here can see the date. Yeah. Okay, let me know if you know in the in the uh, peanut gallery. And next we have Okay, so this one is of Madame Medusa with Brutus and Nero. Look at that one. That's very cool. on her swamp boat. Okay. Next we have this looks like it's a small one. Okay, and this one is a hidden Mickey pin. And this one was one that I'm surprised that they didn't have already, but it's little penny. P for penny. Cover that. Okay. And the final one is in this big package. <clears throat> what do we have in here? Okay, and this final one is huge. It is a profile pin, and it's got Madame Medusa in the center, Brutus and Nero, Penny, or Teddy Bear, and uh, Bernard and Bianca. And on the back, it's a fantasy pin. There's DDD fantasy pins, uh, limited edition 50. And look at that, like printed on it are Bernard and Bianca. That is awesome. I didn't realize how, how big that pin was. Yay! Okay, so next up, we have this one from my friend Marcy Mouse. And uh, she was doing another... She al she's always doing a lot of sale, one or the other. And I'm going to go ahead and open this one up. Okay, and here's her information. And I will be sure to put her information and all the information of other sellers down below if they have given me a card. Uh, I'm always happy to spread the word. I know like Jake and I constantly go back and forth buying stuff that we see on each other's things um, because we like a lot of the same stuff. And how could you not? Okay, so as always, uh, Marcy likes to wrap her things. Oops, it's got a little torn, but that's okay. usually includes a map and this one got a little bit torn but that's okay uh, I'm here for the pins mostly so I remember now I got the Lost Boys like I got all of the Lost Boys I got Cubby that was one of them and then Nibs the Fox I got Toodles the Skunk and I got the twins, the Raccoon twins. And then the other pin that I got from her was, uh, this is a limited edition pin from 
uh, Disney Parks, 2016, and it is of Inside Out. With sadness, joy, and bing bong. Very cool. Okay, now I have this pin. This is from um, France. And I had gotten, oh wait, is this from France? No, oh, I'm sorry, from the United Kingdom. This is from the United Kingdom. And, oh yes, now I remember what these are. Okay, so I had bought a few pins from her before. And she goes by Frollo Suit on, on um, Instagram. There it is. And it's got the math maker as Joker. Frollo suit. Also on Etsy. Thank you for your order. It means the world to me. Please leave a review on Etsy and tag us on Instagram. Chloe Frollo suit. Yes, I will be sure to do that. So, um, she does like these great mouse detective stamp pins. And she does other great mouse detective pins too. Like there was one of the, um, uh, ballet dancer that she did and this is fidget it's a stamp pin and then this one is of dawson now this one she had listed as um like severely defective but i don't see anything wrong with this pin i mean i'm not the most uh you know what is that? Judicious in, in uh, um, checking damage of pins and things like that, like blemishes and stuff. Like it doesn't bother me that much if it, like, if it isn't standing out so much. And I think it looks fine. So I'm totally excited about that one. Okay, this one is from uh, John from Paxton, Illinois. And I forget what this is. Oh, yes. Okay. So, um, this is, you remember me just talking just recently, like was in this video, about uh, Jake and I going back and forth and buying things from places that we have. I was just trying to see if we left a card in here. Um, but uh, I got this pen after watching one of Jake's videos. I'm gonna have to look at his video to figure out where I bought this pen from because I can't remember. I, on Etsy, I can look up my Etsy order and then I'll, I'll put it down in the comments below. But he gave me some candy, which is always nice. And then look at this. It is a thing to behold. It is the um, Disney Afternoon pin, and it's got Monterey Jack and Summy Dummy, Gizmo Duck, Gyro Gear Loose, um, Grammy Dummy. It's got Zipper and Gadget and Webbedale. So that's going to go very nicely as the centerpiece of my Disney Afternoon slash Disney Channel slash. ABC pin. <laughs> okay, and then we have a final package. Okay, so here's what I got from Box Lunch. So I finally bit the bullet and got this stretching portrait that they they released with Constance and Sally Slater. And I wasn't going to get them because this is my least favorite of the stretching portraits. This is the, uh, let me, let's try to stretch it out for you so you can see what it looks. Oh wait, I have to take it off the back or I forgot. I to do this. Um, so 
I was not going to get this one because this is my least favorite is the three guys on uh, quick, in quicksand. Um, but the reason why I ended up getting this is because they did release one. This is, um, I forget his name, Alexander something something, but he's the guy on the dynamite and they released him so I decided I can't just have three now, I have to have all four. So I ended up getting those. Then I also got the Madame Leota kind of tarot card looking pin. It's smaller than what it looks like on the website, but, you know, that's par for the course for these lounge fly pins. Well, I guess they're not necessarily lounge fly. But, but, okay, then I got this recycled pin of Everybody Wants to Be a Cat with the Scat Cat and the Three Euros Kittens. I thought that that was cute. And then this other recycled one of Snow White walking in the dark uh, with the evil queen lurking over her. Again, on the website it looks much bigger. <laughs> it's very small, uh, but it's a beautiful pin. It's a beautiful pin. All right, well that is it. Uh, for today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed yourself. Let me know which one was your favorite pin that I opened today. I think I have two favorites and I'll show you them. One of them is the Disney Afternoon pin because it's glorious. And then I also love this Rescuers pin which again is glorious. And I think it's interesting that they had Madame Medusa as a central point rather than Bernard and Bianca, but I don't care. I love Madame Medusa, so there's that. All right, well, if you had fun today, we would love it if you would subscribe to our channel, hit the bell for notifications, and do like this post as it really does help us out. Visit us on all of our socials down below. Visit our website at www.castlescapesandclothes.com. And with that, we will see you later. Bye!